I don't know if I even say the names. Kancho. <laughs> Isn't it not Kancho? It's like Tancho. I hate these them. are these are traditional Korean drinks. Let me explain. What... No, I'm not gonna let you hate on my favorite drink. Super cool, but we keep lighting fires. Don't want you be cause we're scared of the silence. We should be cool, but we keep lighting fires, fires around ourselves. Здравейте и добре дошли в днешното видео, в което заедно с Джош ще пробваме много различни чипсове, сладки неща и напитки. От тук нататък видеото ще е на английски. Нямам търпение да хапам. Okay. What are we trying first? I, I think we should try the snacks first and then move on to the drinks because we'll get thirsty while we are having all of these dry snacks. Right? Yes, we're basically trying Korean snacks, different types. Yes, yes. Some of which I've tried, some of them. Some are completely new to me. Can't wait to eat them. And you've tried everything basically. I have absolutely tried all of them, yes. Uh, except except one, this one. No, you have. I've never tried ah, these. Ah, the seaweed. I've never tried I those. picked this one. Yeah, but I've tried all of these. And again, like I mentioned in my last video, <laughs> this is just a fraction of This is barely snacks. touching the surface. Yeah, literally. Let's see. Maybe we can start with something we've had already. <clears throat> okay, okay. No, I, I think I, I think we should start yeah. with this. <laughs> but it's really bad. We have oh, two flavors. Two. Okay, yeah. We have original flavor. Original flavor. And this is basically dried up seaweed. Seaweed. They've had they've like a rice flour. Yeah. And they've kind of put seaweed on top and then I think they baked it. Oh, so it's okay. not just seaweed itself. Like a seaweed thin cake. Yeah. Yeah, oven baked. Yes. And this one is barbecue plate. Let's try the original one. I'm quite scared now. Yeah? Why? Well, you don't want it to be bad. I don't want it to be bad. I never want anything to be bad, but sometimes it's like it's all right. Oh, this smells really nice. I actually like seaweed, just the seaweed you yeah, would use to, I don't know, wrap sushi. We have it at home and I'll just eat it. It's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty good. Yeah? Right. Yeah, it's pretty good. You don't like it? You know I like anything seaweed. <clears throat> I think it's all right. There's a little bit of um, sweetness to it. There's um, a little bit of saltiness and I mean, obviously crispiness. It's nice, it's nice. The texture is really nice. Taste, it can be a bit more intense. Yeah, but I don't think that's the point of this. Oh, this is definitely something I can have. I can have the whole pack. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's move on to the barbecue flavor. Ooh. <laughs> I'm not convinced. <laughs> you know what it smells like? What? Like um, the, um, uh, when, when we cook um, noodles, the flavoring. Uh, no, this smells like um, there's another snack, another Korean snack, and it smells just like that. Obviously, like, there's no point explaining what that smells because... I like this too. Yeah, you guys don't know. Because I can taste the seaweed here, but I can also taste the barbecue. Uh, no, I don't like this one. You don't? Mm. Well, there, there's a bit of a kick at the end. It does say spicy. Hot spicy. Ah, uh, yeah. <coughs> it, it's not that spicy, it just has a little bit of kick. I didn't expect it. Okay, cool. I'm thirsty already. Actually, some water would be good. Okay, we, we, we have drinks here. <laughs> you know I hate all of them! <laughs> okay. No, we are fancy. Let's open one that you've not tried before. Okay, wait for me now. Okay. We're having water from a wine glass because I can't reach the water glasses. Okay, so here is a drink. Bong bong. <laughs> That's literally the name of it. Bong bong. <laughs> bong bong. Yeah, bong bong. This is a grape. Um, juice? Yeah, grape juice. So it's a sadder version of wine. I'm not gonna tell you anything about this other than that it's, it's, it's a grape flavored juice or grape juice. They're pieces, right? They're pieces. Let me tell the people first. There are two of Josh's favorite drinks here. We'll get to them. Mm -hmm. There are two of his favorite drinks right here. He loves them. I hate these them. Are, these are traditional Korean drinks. <laughs> let me explain why no, I hate them. No, no, I'm not gonna let you hate on my favorite drink. The one is um, rice punch. And the other one is cinnamon punch. Um, one is obviously made with rice inside. It's really sweet. Like you have it cold, you have it during the summer. Same for the cinnamon punch. It has a bit of spice from the cinnamon um, and other good things. I don't even know <laughs> the ingredients exactly. Good things. These are really good. Anyways, you have it typically during the summer. I love these, especially the rice punch. It actually has rice in them, as I said, and you, you know, basically sure I need that, right? Tony hates them. Tony hates them. I don't care. Not because of the flavor. I don't care. Not because of the She's hating all my favorite drinks. <laughs> Not because of the flavor or any of the things inside, but because of the pieces, the bits and pieces of rice. And there is also rice in this drink. I just... No, there's no rice. Oh, no. There is something. No, cinnamon um, and other spices oh they've left the ginger the spice in there no they haven't just a clear okay. liquid okay oh my goodness try it it's nice it smells nice it's really nice this one is nice what's inside <laughs> just 
Come on. Oh shit. <laughs> I saw it. It's floating there. I don't want this to get to me. Okay, fine. It's an actual grape. Oh. It's an actual grape. Why does the flavor have to be so good and then for stuff to float around? It's an actual there? grape. Oh. But actually, that's just me. It's personal preference. You don't have to down on all these drinks. Your tummy is going to hurt. It's not gonna hurt. Oh no, I'm talking to you like a three-year-old. <laughs> Let's move on. Okay, next. You you, you pick now. I really okay. want to try this one. This one's supposed to be a bit sweet. Yeah, there, there's a bit of sweetness from the rice itself. I think I don't I don't think they put sugar inside. Okay. But I'm no, not there really is sure. sugar. Oh, there, there is sugar, sugar okay. and corn syrup and gelatin. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So this is a, also like a traditional snack, like a proper traditional snack. That's it, I think. And it's just a rice cracker, yeah, as it says. That's why I don't open the. You don't. No, no. <laughs> and what do I do? I just bite into it? Yeah. <laughs> How is it? These don't have like a really strong flavor. And that's the point of some of the snacks. Like some snacks, it's not supposed to have strong flavor. And you enjoy the taste of rice or, you know, things like this. Just a plain thing. You see, I don't know how you come to a conclusion about the taste of something when trying it just one time. I, I need to go for another bite. Mm, keep going, keep going. If there is nothing, in the drawer, <laughs> I'll have it. <laughs> but it's not my favorite thing. That's actually all right, not bad. Like it's missing something. <clears throat> Maybe if it was covered in chocolate, that's a great idea. I mean, no, what you only appreciate is strong flavor. There is a taste here. There is, there is, it's just very mild. And that's the point of this. Oh, there's rice there. Where is rice? Oh, ho. He's got <laughs> rice hair, he's there. Well, then whose hair is it? <laughs> yeah, Josh, whose hair is it? Mm, I don't know, you Okay, now. Next, Korean Cheetos. I don't think I need to explain much. It's Cheetos, 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 whatever. Yeah. I've, ne I've never tried them before. I, I, no, I've never, I had never tried Cheetos before and I, the first time I tried was a few months ago. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Cheetos I've seen in Bulgaria is slightly different to the Korean Cheetos or I think some of the American ones or whatever. I'm not an expert in Cheetos. But anyways, this is also different. Maybe you guys, Wait, right. should we show the package? Yes. It's a lot more crunchy, obviously different flavors as well. Do it. it doesn't smell too nice. But we tried one already. Uh, the other like one, yeah, 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 yeah. There, there, I think two flavors they sell in this, um, the K-Food Korean shop. It doesn't smell too nice, Is does it? Is it chicken? One. Smoky barbecue flavor. Cheetos can do better. They do do better. I think this is actually all right. It didn't smell too appetizing, but it tastes pretty good. I like it. Mm. I like that it has a sweetness. Mm. Mm. I could munch down on this while we were watching TV or something. I saw something here. Can that be next, please? Yeah, <laughs> sure. I've recently fallen in love with this snack. I had tried it before once and I didn't like it at all. And then you brought it or your mom sent it to us. I don't remember. And then I tried it a second time and my life, my life changed. It's been changed ever since. Ah, it says honey flavored twist back. I think you were talking about the sweet potato one, not this one. Mm. So then this I've never tried. You don't like it? Hmm. It's trying to be like the sweet potato one, but it's not doing a very good job. <laughs> so it's obviously very sweet, obviously crunchy. Maybe you guys will be able to hear it, but this is not my favorite one. But I think a lot of you guys will like this because it's sweet, cr crunchy, all that unhealthy jazz. I'm starting to like <laughs> it. It takes time. <laughs> Please let it not be the white milky one. This one. This is another grape flavored juice. With little grapes inside. It says cocoa palm. In Korean it's coco palm. Coco palm. <laughs> yeah, coco palm. Does it need anything? No. <laughs> so it says coconut jelly. Jelly. There are the coconut jellies inside. There are these aloe vera drinks. You, you must have seen them or had them. They came to Bulgaria. A lot of people like them. You know? Many years ago, yes. I hate them. Not because of the taste. Taste is really nice. They're really refreshing when cold. But the little bits of aloe vera, the jelly. You shook it so I can have some <laughs> jelly, right? <coughs> Evil person. <clears throat> Ugh. It's really jelly, jelly, jelly. But the taste is so nice, it's such a shame. Yeah, I actually prefer the taste of this. I feel like it's a slightly more artificial, tasty thing. I like it, it's really refreshing, but I am drinking really carefully. I have a strategy where I put my lip over the thing. So if the jelly comes, it will meet my lip first. My lip will reject it and I will only <laughs> let the liquid in. Baby, stop wasting the drink. Wasting? You're wasting the drink. I can pour, pour out the jellies after for you. Let's move on, okay? 
let's try let's try these i know i like them mm -hmm. and they're a bit <clears throat> spicy and savory yeah so this one is called in korean kokai kon it used to be an actual cone shaped that's why it's called kokai kokai kon which is you know like a cone i get it but now for some reason which i really hate they've changed the shape and it doesn't taste as good so do you think the shape is what changed the flavor but no i, th I think they've also changed the flavor slightly with the recipe but Shame anyways on you. i'm really disappointed because this used to be one of my favorites but we went through uh, uh, quite a few packages your mom sent us lots of these and we had them all i think i bought them i like this one what i don't like is the red one this is nice no it's not the same i don't know what it used to taste like but it's nice 100 times better than this it's like sweet corn this is so good and you know back in the days when it used to be a uh, shape of cones we would like put them on our fingers and eat them like this but now you can't even do that take it away i will eat it okay. time for another drink that's what i meant if you say another grape <laughs> no i think this is soy, soy milk soy milk yeah, yeah soy milk but I think it's different to the normal soy milk. Of course get. it is. I'm sure. Yeah, Korean I'm sure it has different. bits of soy in there. Always well, gotta shake it. And there's a story behind this one. This doctor back in the days, like 1920s, mm -hmm. saw that loads of kids were dying because of you know malnutrition and stuff like yeah. this. It's either around 1920s or it's around Korean War, 1950s or something like this. I can't remember exactly. But this doctor. Obviously, he felt sorry for the kids dying of malnutrition, and so he made milk out of s soy beans to um, give nutrition to the kids. That's so sweet. Yeah, That's such and a sweet story. and I think this company, if I remember correctly, they still do like really good things for the society. They give always back to the society. I think, if I remember correctly. That's really nice. Yeah. Anyways, and the taste is also really good. <laughs> Why am I here? No, come on, have have one more sip. How old was it? You must like this. I used to love this as a kid. Come okay, on. Okay, okay. I'll give it another go. You know, if you put some chocolate, like some cacao powder, beautiful. If there's someone out there who don't mind straight on milk, try this. I think this is also completely vegan or vegetarian. But yeah, you see it has quite a bit of nutrition yeah. stuff. Calcium. <clears throat> vitamin D, iron, yeah. vitamin C, something I can't read, vitamin B, zinc. Calcium, potassium. Time for something sweet. My favorite. Let me present you my favorite. How do you say them? Pepero. <laughs> pepero. <laughs> They're not called pepero. <laughs> what are they called? In, pepero. In Korean, it's pepero. Let me tell the people now about pepero. 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 Yeah. They're the best. <laughs> pepero. <laughs> They're the best. Let me tell you, they are the best. It's basically what is a word in English for this? I don't know. It's, baby. It sticks. In Bulgaria, we call them suleti. Suleti? Mm. Oh, it is suleti. Yeah, suleti with chocolate. <laughs> this is what this is. But it's different types. This one, the chocolate is inside the suleti. <laughs> this one is the original one. So the suleti are covered in chocolate. There must be a name for this in English. It literally says stick biscuit. <laughs> Let's call it stick biscuit. And this one, I have never tried. <clears throat> I picked it out myself from the shop. It's basically Oreo. Yeah, sticks, sticks, so. biscuit sticks, and this is peanuts and chocolate. It's covered in bits of peanuts. We've we've tried all of this except this one, so let's try this one. Okay. And we can we can okay. not open those. We're not going to open those. I opened one of these yesterday, and I had to <clears> open <throat> myself. So it's in a box like this, and it comes with a packaging like this. And you open these. I like to open these. I know a lot of you people like to open tear it like this that's not my way sorry baby i didn't know there is a right way and a wrong way <gasps> that doesn't look too good <laughs> <laughs> and the way i eat them of course tony goes for the like good bit i always go for the uh, boring yeah not good bit plain biscuit mm. because i can enjoy the good bit only afterwards mm, it's not bad it's not mm, pretty good it's nice mm. let me get a refreshing drink hopefully everything's at the bottom now you're trying I'm to done with this one. there is a jelly stuck of course you're done baby give it your stomach! <laughs> Her stomach's fine. I'm already kind of getting full. I mean, we literally just had dinner as well. Yeah. <laughs> now, next one, I'm gonna introduce the intri an, uh, an interesting one. I mean, I'm sure there is one like this in Bulgaria. I've never. So, these are chestnuts, boiled chestnuts. No. 
Yeah, you boil chestnuts. No, these are Steamed. roasted. Okay, roasted, even better. Mm -hmm. We have chestnuts a lot in Bulgaria. It's one of my favorite things to mm -hmm. have during like yeah, uh, winter yeah. time. But I've <clears throat> never seen like you know a fancy packaged ones. I've I've seen them raw, like you buy them and cook them yourself yeah, at yeah. home. Yeah. So in Korea, you can obviously buy the raw ones from the shops mm -hmm. what you can also do which is a lot of people do is you can actually go and find a tree shake it down <laughs> and pick it up and actually one of my uncles did hurt his back because he fell down from a tree whilst oh, no. shaking the when tree. i was really young me and my friends used to do that because yeah. in my old neighborhood near my mom's place there are lots of chest mm. trees okay. so i'll pick lots of them i would play with them i don't know what maybe we'll throw them at each other but i remember i would so get lots of, lots of them and take them to my mom and my grandma to cook but i do remember my grandma telling me that there are different types of chestnuts and some of them are inedible you can't yeah, just some of yeah. them if you, you die great i bought i brought uh, poisonous chestnuts home yeah but anyways in korea on the streets what you can also get is like they're literally people on the streets roasting them yeah and you can buy the roasted ones and obviously a slightly more convenient one and also a slightly more expensive one is packaged one like this like all prepared for you to just eat yeah, they have no peel. You don't have to peel anything. Next. Oh, I'm exhausted from eating. Do you like this? I do like this. Me too. My grandma also likes So this is called Achimesal, which means morning sunshine. Really? <laughs> and it says, uh, eat breakfast. <laughs> so this is breakfast? No, no, no. I think it's just promoting you should have breakfast, but it's called achmesa and this is made from rice. Would you pair it with something? I, I was thinking maybe it's, you know, like buza. Buza? No. You, you didn't shake? I will shake it. I'll have a taste. I don't think you're gonna like this, but try. <laughs> there are lots of bubbles as well. <laughs> Really not like Do you that. know what this tastes like? What? This tastes exactly as if we were to cook rice, <coughs> not let the whole water absorb, mm -hmm. put the rice water mm -hmm. and put some sugar <coughs> in. Literally, I think. Yeah? Yeah, I think so. These drinks are really not my thing. Like the milky ones, no, no. The other ones, taste wise, 10 out of 10. But when you start putting jelly. I'm in getting them, so full. Because you've drunk so much. Stop drinking! <laughs> this is what makes you, you feel full. <laughs> I can't believe I have to go through all of this. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually really full. <laughs> Do you want to do a second part of this video and film tomorrow? Uh, no, we, we we spent such a long time setting all, all of this up, so we okay. must do it today. We just go <clears throat> through it quickly and we just try one. What about the strips? Don't touch them. They're going to be my hands. So, in Korean it's called the ice <laughs> chip. Translation is egg, shrimp, chip. My English friends used to love these. Yeah, so when we were in school, my mom would send like a big box just full of snacks, noodles and everything. And my friends would go mental. They were like, Josh, your package from your mom has come. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, let me check. And they were like, oh, oh, can, I, can I buy that off of you? I'll give you five pounds. <laughs> I'm not joking. Would you just take the money? Of course. Oh, good. <laughs> good businessman. Five pounds? I could buy a whole kebab with mm. that. <laughs> This reminds me, hopefully that's not offensive, but this reminds me, you know, in Chinese restaurants, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. they'll give you these like popped, popped crisps. Mm -hmm. Is that what they're called? I think it's pretty much exactly the same thing. But these are making my mouth really dry today for some reason. They don't normally do this. Here, I'll share my drink with you. I promise not to have it all. Oh, okay. You're going to down it. Thanks. Next, some kanchu. <laughs> kanchu is good. I don't know why you say the names. Kanchu. <laughs> Isn't it not kanchu? It's like danchu. <laughs> <laughs> it's kanchu. Kanchu. Exactly. Well, it's really cute and it, it's nice. It's <clears throat> nothing... Nothing special. Yeah, it's nothing special. It's, but... it's a little biscuit with chocolate inside. Obviously not like a normal biscuit. You're not filming. Why would you do this to me? Now I should try everything again for the video. This yeah. is nice. Cancho. You know, classic. Uh, actually, most of the snacks... Yeah, you can take seaweed and maybe the chestnut. All of them have been around probably like 20, 30, 40 years. So th these are all really classic. That's why I've said in cave food, they have the classics because these are the classics. Cave food is a supermarket where we've gotten everything from. I think I said it earlier, but yeah, it's in the center. I don't know the street, but I know how to get there from here. That's the important thing. <laughs> Stop <You know>, eating. <laughs> do you know what country tastes like? What? Like a biscuit, 
This field with some um, Nesquik. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Next, we'll go for another classic. Okay. It's called Seokang Shrimp Flavored Cracker. So this is also another very, very classic thing. Some people have it with beer. And also when you go to like um a, like a beer place in Korea, yeah. they'll just give you this. It's because it's crunchy and it's, um, yeah, it has you... a nice taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, li I like this. Ah, beware though. When you open this, you will smell lots of fishy just coming out from this thing. Yeah, it does smell like yeah. a fish shop. Don't be put off because the taste wise is not bad. I mean, I like this, but it's, I wouldn't say this is one of my favorites, but it's something I would also have if there is some. Mm. If you're a fan of seafood, you're gonna like this. Mm. What are having next? Let's try the onion rings. One of my favorites. It's called yangpa ring in Korean, onion rings. Yangpa is onion, ring is ring. I, I grew up with, I mean, I grew up with pretty much all of these. If you can't open it from the top, open it from the bottom. <sighs> If you like onions, you like this. I love onions. I love garlic. But it's not I love like everything. It's not like it's not like really oniony. Mm, it's not. It's, it, it, there, there is a bit of sweetness to it. Mm, mm. it it's nice. I really like this. It's not my favorite. Yeah, it's not Tony's favorite. She's weird. Now this doesn't have anything inside. It's just plain liquid. And I liked it. I don't think so. I don't think you did. This smells like the. Um, Mold wine, yeah. like Christmas. This is this is what. Oh God, no! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I would say this, but that's too much Christmas. That's too much Christmas in one sip. Mm -hmm. This is way too strong. You, you're gonna feel even more full. Sorry. <clears throat> yeah. So these two actually reminded me. I used to work in a Korean restaurant when I was in London, and we used to sell rice punch and obviously cinnamon punch, which is basically this. But instead of selling them like this, mm -hmm. I had to dilute the extract or concentrate and mix it with water and I remember <laughs> being a bad employee I guess <laughs> making some for the customer obviously mm -hmm. serve mm -hmm. and then make make some little bit for myself add some ice and just like have it because mm -hmm. I, I used to get really hot and just on the side it like behind the bar just mm -hmm. go this definitely needs to be diluted a bit more no it doesn't it's too strong. that's perfect okay. that's perfect let's try I have not tried this I'm really looking forward to this yeah this one Good, you said it's good. Yeah, it's good. But like the image I have, so it's called Wujingwa Tangkong, which means squid peanut. When I was younger, only old people would have. It's been 40 years. The, 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 the recipe is 40 years old or something. Oh. Well, it's been around for 40 years. Yeah, you, you can smell like seafoody and peanuts. If you're allergic to peanuts, don't have it. This peanuts. smells amazing. <laughs> oh my God, can I smell this again? Oh, <laughs> I love anything peanuts. How is it? I'm not, the, I'm not the biggest fan of this, but that's all right. Well, you can have it all because I'm not a big fan of this. I never was. If you like peanuts, you're gonna love this. But um, what if you don't like seafood? I can't taste any anything in seafood. But it's this bowl of something and inside there is an actual peanut. Cool, great. Now we're down to three. Three snacks. We've gone through so many. Three snacks I'm gonna and one up in a minute. I'm so full. Because you filled your belly with liquid. Mwah. Okay, what do you want to try now? Well, let's try this. I did not, I was going to say, I didn't buy this to be part of the video. I actually bought it to snack. <coughs> Sorry. You okay? Yep. No. I bought it to snack on it in the car because I was really hungry, but then I <laughs> forgot about it. Yeah, so this is seaweed. In Korea, we would have seaweed with you know, general milk, you know, with rice. But, of course, Koreans and some other people, we love seaweed. We just have them, you know, like this as well. I love it. It's called Kim. Kim. I love it. Kim. Softer. It's not K. It's more like G. Kim. Kim. Yeah, exactly. Kim. Kim. That's G. It is not K. It's not K. Kim. The pronunciation is not K. My, my mum's surname is Kim. Yeah? Yeah. But she calls a penguin. You started. <laughs> you started. Calling her penguin because she Why would you call my mom penguin? Stop it now, people are gonna take this seriously. Another another thing on my list. Controlling maniac uh, a disrespectful wife. You said your mom look looked like a penguin and she yeah. does. She's really quick. So my mom quick, quick cute. Quick quick <laughs> My mom. She looks um because she's getting a little bit of weight and she looks like this penguin from this animated film. From Madagascar. Is it from Madabas Madagascar? Yes, it's yeah. from Madagascar. Madagascar. They even have a separate <laughs> film for the penguin. <laughs> yeah. So she she looks like the boss penguin from the from She's that so film. cute. She's so cute. <laughs> 
I even have like a collage where I show I the know. penguin and my mom's face and they look exactly the same. <laughs> she is so cute. Yeah, she's, I, that's how I've saved her in my phone. Penguin. Yeah, penguin. Next one. Next one. This is something I have not tried. Bung you. It's good. <laughs> Softer. <laughs> it's called bung you because oh. these are, I think, um, either corn. They look like corn. Corn crackle or something like this. So, so they make this in like this um, sealed metal container and they heat it up and they rotate. And then when it's ready, um, when they open, it makes a big banging noise. The, the first letter mm -hmm. or first pronunciation, whatever mm -hmm. this is, is called bang because in Korean that's the sound of boom. That's so bang yo. Yeah, anyways. But these are interesting facts. How do you know? When you go on a motorway, mm -hmm. you see quite a few people making these. On the thing and you they like good spin they're so tiny they're so small yeah, this is sweet nothing special this tastes like a cereal there is mm. a cereal yeah, yeah, like yeah. This. but it gets addicted the cereal is better uh you keep having this you'll be like oh, oh. i mean, I mean like, this is, it's not like oh this is amazing like oh it's all right yeah and then you have one and like the other and you just keep going you can't stop yeah so let's stop <laughs> let's yeah, it can be dangerous. Yeah, but it's not like too sweet. It's mm -hmm, not mm -hmm. too mild. It's like per it hits the right spot, and like, you like it's really easy to just come on. Let's get it over and done with. This shit is the best shit. How and many it, times did you say shit? Twice. Ah, another interesting fact. Not interesting, but anyway. So in Korea, we have public baths. I don't know if you know, Koreans, we love public baths. Obviously, like, it's separated into different genders, obviously, you know, male and female. And you have actual public baths where you get naked and actually have a bath. Some of these public baths, what they have is like a common area. After your bath, you, you get dressed and you can go to whatever this common area. And there, they serve this. It's called shikke. Ah, sorry. And this is called... The cinnamon punch is called sujongwa. And this is koko pam. Koko pam. <laughs> <laughs> what they do is like... They get to the point where it's like almost frozen, so there's bits of ice. In but, the drink? Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. in, in the public bath. Mm -hmm. So like, it's ice, but at the same time, it's not. It's, it's like drink. It's it like, they, they have it on this perfect border, and it's like a, it's like slush. Ah, yes. Yeah, but slightly more liquid in them. I slush. don't like slush. There are many things I don't like, actually. Yeah. This is the best drink. Drink. <laughs> Just try it, baby. I've tried it. And also during the summer, my, my grandma used to make this, like homemade. And we put it in the fridge. Have you called? So nice. I don't care. I don't care what kind of face she makes. I love this stuff. It's the best. I've had such a tiny sip and it makes me gag. There's no rice bit. I know. It just tastes as well. It's just whatever. We're finally on the last. Wait. Splish. Splish. Oh, thank you. <laughs> finally on the last one. So we've had earlier this. Kokai corn. This one was what is it, sweet and spicy flavor, and this is original flavor. And this is slightly more. There's a word for it in Korean. Yeah. I don't know. You have many words. Yeah. Oh, Korean. We have so many um, words to, to describe, describe taste, taste and flavors. In English, they're like what five, six, <laughs> barely. It's nice. It's like plain sweet corn, but not too sweet. Yeah. Oh, well, again, it's such a big disappointment for me. I used to love these. But now I'll choose not to have it. But that's obviously my thing. I'm sure a lot of people l still love this. Yeah, and I'm sure a lot of people who try it for the first time will like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since 1983. Since 1983, whoa. How many years is that? Yeah. Quick, quick, quick. 37, 30, 39. Quick, 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 quick. 39. Yes, well done. <laughs> that was it. Now it's time to hide all the drinks from I Josh. Not speak with my mouth full. That's something I've learned from the UK. I mean, and in Korea, you do? Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, also in Korea, it's not like particularly rude to um, make noises while you're yeah. like slurping, slurping. Make, like you know making noise. Yeah. It's not particularly rude. The, these uh, noises they trigger something in me. Just in general, like, in Western world, it's like a particularly rude to make any kind yeah, of I noise guess. while you're eating. But in Korea, you just go for it. Yeah, yeah. Right, she... I mean, of course, some people also hate How it. How did you get out of the corridor? Huh? He's out. What? Let's put him back in. <laughs> I told you, stop it with the drinks! I'm sure you're gonna have indigestion. You're gonna be in bed like, oh, stop! You don't have one. Много ви благодаря, че гледахте днешното видео. Ако ви е харесало, може да го харесате и да се абонирате за канала ми, в случай, че не сте. Също така имам и влог канал, ако предпочитате седмични влогове. Линк към инстаграм профил ми има в описанието. Прегрещам ви, севам ви и до скоро.
We should be good, but we keep out of fire. We keep on talking and talking, talking and talking.